Hello again, everyone. Randy Rogers, Mortgage Loan Originator with Trinity Oaks Mortgage here. Today, I wanted to talk about those mysterious closing costs associated with purchasing a mortgage. There's a long list of items that a home buyer has to account for, and it usually ends up somewhere in the range of two to 5% of the purchase price of the house. So what are these costs? I won't go over all of them because you don't want to watch me for that long, I'm sure, but here are a few of the big ones. First, we have the origination fee. This is a fee that the mortgage lender charges to put together your mortgage. It also is referred to as an underwriting fee or an administrative fee sometimes, and it's typically around 0.5% of the price of the home, but some companies charge a flat fee. Similarly, when you close on a home purchase, a title company will do the honors and will charge a closing title or escrow fee. This is typically a fixed amount that varies depending on location. It pays for the title company to search county records to ensure that the seller has no liens or other conditions that would prevent them from selling. They also will create a new deed for the sale. Related to these title fees are the lenders and owners title insurance fees. Now, the lender's title insurance protects the mortgage lender in a case where something was missed in the title search process and someone tries to claim ownership of the property after the sale. The owner's title policy does the same thing for the buyer. A deed recording fee is a charge required for the title company to file a new deed of ownership with the county where the house resides. This is typically a pretty nominal amount. Finally, a final inspection fee pays for a final inspection done near closing day. Uh, this is a last check to make sure the home is in good shape with no significant issues that would cause the value of the home to be diminished below the appraised amount. And this protects the buyer and the lender. I know there's a lot of these things and it can be quite confusing if you're the buyer. And that's what I'm here for. If you're looking to buy a home in the state of Texas, and I can be of any assistance at all, you can contact me or even apply today through my website, trinityoaksmortgage.com slash R-R-O-D-G-E-R-S. Thank you, and I hope you have a blessed day.